What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pilling here, your YouTube world. Here's the champion here on YouTube. And I'm coming to my WWE SmackDown review for May 22nd, 2018. That is right. So let's get things going, shall we? The John Squad. We kicked off WWE SmackDown Live with Miz TV. And the Miz talks about him coming to SmackDown Live. And on July 24th at 10 p.m., that Miz and Mrs. is going to debut. So he introduces his guest, The New Day. And The New Day are happy to be on Miz TV. And that they said they are not going to watch Miz and Mrs. on July 24th at 10 p.m. So the Miz is trying to say now which one of them are going to compete in the um, men's Money in the Bank line match. He wants to know who, so the Miz is going asking them who is going to compete. So they're like saying like, who, who, who is going to compete? So they don't know who is going to be competing. And so the Miz is, so then Xavier Woods tells him is that he is a living legend, but... Everybody doesn't like him. So then they go on. And so then the Miz goes on and talks about each member of the New Day and stuff like that. And just goes on and talks about them. So then the New Day. So then the Miz says that he could beat be every one of the New Day. But then what happens here is that Big E wants to fight the Miz. And the New Day says that they want him to fight the Miz. So then the Miz backs out. So then this leads up to the New Day throwing pancakes at the Miz. Which I thought was hilarious. And they say shame, shame, shame. As the Miz is trying to leave me heads to the back. They're just throwing pancakes at him. But then what happens is that Paige tells the Miz to get to the ring. And you have a match against Big E. So then the first match you on SmackDown was The Miz versus Big E. And the winner of that match was The Miz because during the match, the bar, Sheamus and Cesaro, come out during the match and attack the New Day on ringside and attack Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston. And those two guys were on commentary too, but then the Kofi Kingston attacks Cesaro and Sheamus, but then, you know, and that led to a distraction for Big E to lose with, with the chaos that was happening on ringside. So then the second match we on SmackDown was a Money in the Bank qualifying match. was Lana versus Billy K. And the winner was Lana. And it is Lana Day. That is right because Lana picked up her first one on one victory. That is just awesome, man. That is just awesome. Congratulations to Lana. Click a thumbs up for Lana if you are happy for her that she picked up her first one on one victory because every day now it's going to be Lana Day. That is right. Then the third match we had on SmackDown was. Andre Cena Lama versus a local job. I didn't even know Catch's name, and it was uh, probably yeah, Yahoo Prince. I think that's what his name. I couldn't really catch it, but and the winner was of course Andre Cena Lamas, and that was the winner. So then we had it in the seminar on SmackDown with Shinsuke Nakamura and AJ Styles. We go face to face. And Shinsuke Nakamura says his title is is going to become his now at Money in the Bank and. And this is going to be his house that hit. And this is going to be his house that he built, and you know, and that, and that, that, that he reveals a stipulation, and he says that this is going to be a pillow fight, and he was only joking, supposedly. AJ Styles says to him, "Is that uh, what you call that?" Uh, AJ Styles says that he doesn't care whatever stipulation he picks and stuff like that, but what stipulation he picks and stuff like that. So then AJ Styles and Shinsuke Nakamura brawl. They go into the crowd. They brawl. Shinsuke Nakamura delivers a Kinshasa, and then Nakamura's count to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9 and 10. That's right. And the stipulation that Shinsuke Nakamura picked for their match at Money in the Bank for the WWE Championship is a last man standing match. That's going to be awesome right there. So then the next match on SmackDown was a number one contenders match for the SmackDown Tag Team Towels to face the Bludgeon Brothers at Money in the Bank. We had was the 
Usos versus Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. And the winner was the new SmackDown number one contenders for the SmackDown tag team titles was Luke Gallows and Carl Andersons who, who, who get to face the Bludgeon Brothers at Money in the Bank for the SmackDown tag team titles. So then the fifth match you had SmackDown was a women's Money in the Bank qualifying match. Naomi versus Sonya Deville. And the winner of that match was Naomi, and she qualifies for the women's Money in the Bank ladder match now. Whew, man. And next week on SmackDown, we are going to get Sheamus and Cesaro, The Bar, and The Miz versus The New Day. That is right. That's who we're getting. So then the main event we had smacked was a first time ever match. Daniel Bryan, yes, 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 versus the United States champion, Jeff Hardy. Da -na 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 -na. Da -na -na -na. That's right. And the winner was Daniel Bryan, and he, and this is to face Samoa Joe, and the winner was Daniel Bryan, and he faces Samoa Joe next week on SmackDown Live. But then after the match, Samoa Joe. And gets on the mic and says that I don't know what everybody saw bringing him up because next week you face me. So then Samoa Joe goes to the back, gets an interview from one of the ladies back there, and then just says that uh, next week he is going to put Daniel Bryan to sleep. And that's what ends to be SmackDown last night with Daniel Bryan doing yes. Yes, yes, in the ring. And that's what ends to be SmackDown last night. So. <sighs> that was a lot to talk about, let me tell you. So once again, the John Squad, please like this video. Tap that bell on your YouTube app so you never miss an upload all my videos. You mean a lot to me, the John Squad. I love each and every single one of you guys. You all mean a lot to me in my heart, and I love film filming for you guys every day. So you really do mean a lot to me, and uh, I love doing these reviews for you guys. So... Like this video, leave your comments down below, and subscribe for more. Peace out, the John Squad. And when you subscribe, you become a champion here on this channel. Peace.